Hello there, my food porn perverts. Welcome to another episode of Food Porn Friday. Now, I know I've been doing a lot of food reviews around town. That's because it was summertime and it was really super hot and it was so hot that I couldn't cook. But I am back in the kitchen now that the temperature has cooled down and I am back with two new recipes for you guys today. On my left, we have this beautiful pull apart caramel bread and this gorgeous, delectable pepperoni pizza bun. pepperoni pizza buns we are going to need a can of jumbo biscuits one tablespoon of butter two cups of chopped pepperoni one small can of black olives sliced and uh, one cup of pasta sauce divided you're also going to need two cups of mozzarella cheese and we're going to be dividing that too so now that we know what goes into this, we're going to put it all together and get the party started. And now for our first step, we're going to combine the cheese, the pepperoni, the black olives, and the sauce all into one bowl. up this can of biscuits because I wanted to save you all the trauma of hearing that little little pop because you know that's always so traumatizing and I hate that so the first thing we're gonna do is that we're going to lay our biscuits up just like this and then we're gonna flatten these babies in the last frame, what we're going to do is that we're going to put this right in the middle of the biscuits and we are going to do a nice helping of that on each biscuit and then we're going to roll them into little balls that kind of like look like uh, buns. before we stick them in the oven we are going to take our butter which I've already melted in the microwave and we are going to be putting this over our little pizza buns and now we're gonna put these in the oven for about 30 to 40 minutes Okay you guys, here it is, 35 minutes later, our pizza buns are completely baked. And now we're just going to do the topping of the pasta sauce. 
And we want to make sure that all of our buns are covered. And if it's not completely 100% covered, we can just go over it with a spoon, like so. And then we're just going to top this off with some cheese. And then we're going to stick it back in the oven for about five minutes until the cheese melts. Alright, here it is. These are my pizza buns. And now we're going to go on to the next dish, which will be the caramel pull-apart bread. Here's what you're going to need for your caramel pull-apart bread. Once again, you're going to need a big thing of jumbo biscuits which you're going to be dividing into 16 sections you're going to need at least two tablespoons of butter you're going to need some brown sugar to stick on the biscuits before you put them in the bread pan one cup of packed brown sugar and one cup of granulated sugar for the topping and you're also when you're making the topping you're going to have to use a quarter cup of half and half and another couple tablespoons of butter so now let's get the party started and put this delicious dessert together. All right, the first thing is first, once again, I spared you the trauma of having to hear that pop. So we're going to take our biscuits out and we're gonna throw the pan away. But here's what is different this time. You notice how in the first recipe I flattened these biscuits. Well. In this next recipe, we're going to cut the biscuits in half, we're going to roll them, and then we're going to make them flat. little biscuit and then we're going to follow it with a little bit of brown sugar. together and I have put as you can tell in the previous clip I have put the butter and the brown sugar in between so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pop this in the oven for about another 35 minutes until they're nice and golden but as they are cooking we're going to make the topping that will go on top of this pull apart bread. all right now next is our caramel sauce. We are going to start adding our quarter cup of half and half into this into this pan along with our sugar right here and our packed brown sugar along with the rest of our butter. And then what we're going to do is that we're going to cook this on medium-high heat for about 20 minutes until it starts bubbling. All right, now for the final step. You remember this caramel sauce I made? We're just going to pour it over our caramel pull-apart bread. 
just like this. And the more caramely, the better. All right, folks, here it is, my caramel pull-apart bread. And now we're gonna put the two together. And I'm going to give you directions and all that fun stuff. So stay tuned. All right, my food porn perverts. This is my pull-apart caramel bread and my delectable pepperoni pizza bun. If you would like to know how you can make both of these dishes, I have included directions in the description box below. Also, if you like what I'm doing on my channel, please hit the subscribe button. And you can also follow me every single Friday on Instagram. Well, I am signing off, but I will see you beautiful people on Monday.